Today's topic is hemolytic anemia. Overview. Hemolytic anemia is a condition in which red blood cells are destroyed and removed from the bloodstream before their normal lifespan is up. A number of diseases, conditions, and factors can cause the body to destroy its red blood cells. Hemolytic anemia can lead to various health problems, such as fatigue, pain, arrhythmias, an enlarged heart, and heart failure. There are many types of hemolytic anemias, some of which are inherited, and others that are acquired. Inherited hemolytic anemias include sickle cell anemia, thalassemias, hereditary spherocytosis, hereditary elliptocytosis, glucose 6-phosphate dehydrogenase, or GGPD deficiency, pyruvate kinase deficiency. Acquired hemolytic anemias include immune hemolytic anemia, autoimmune hemolytic anemia, alloimmune hemolytic anemia, drug-induced hemolytic anemia, mechanical hemolytic anemias, paroxysmal nocturnal hemoglobinuria. Certain infections and substances can also damage red blood cells and lead to hemolytic anemia. Causes The immediate cause of hemolytic anemia is the early destruction of red blood cells. A number of diseases, conditions, and factors can cause the body to destroy its red blood cells. These causes can be inherited or acquired. Sometimes the cause of hemolytic anemia isn't known. In inherited hemolytic anemias, the genes that control how red blood cells are made are faulty. Different types of faulty genes account for the different types of inherited hemolytic anemias. In each type of inherited hemolytic anemia, the body makes abnormal red blood cells. The problem with the red blood cells may involve the hemoglobin, cell membrane, or enzymes that maintain healthy red blood cells. In acquired hemolytic anemias, the body makes normal red blood cells. However, some disease, condition, or factor destroys the cells too early. Examples include immune disorders, infections, and reactions to medicines or blood transfusions. Signs and Symptoms The most common symptom of all types of anemia is fatigue. A low red blood cell count can also cause shortness of breath, dizziness, headache, coldness in your hands or feet, pale skin, gums and nail beds, as well as chest pain. Symptoms of hemolytic anemia include jaundice, pain in the upper abdomen, leg ulcers and pain, a severe reaction to a blood transfusion. Treatment. Treatments for hemolytic anemia include blood transfusions, medicines, plasmapheresis, surgery, blood and marrow stem cell transplants, and lifestyle changes. People who have mild hemolytic anemia may not need treatment, as long as the condition doesn't worsen. People with severe hemolytic anemia usually need ongoing treatment. Risk. Hemolytic anemia can affect people of all ages, races, and sexes. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.